your instructor may choose to use Sakai's discussion forum as part of your class's activities. In this video, we'll help you find a course's discussion forum, create a post, and reply to a classmate's post. To find the discussion forum, visit your course site and click the Forums button in the main menu. In some courses, you may not see a Forums button. Ask your instructor if you have questions about finding the link to the forum. Inside the forum, you should see one or more discussion topics created by your instructor. Below each topic's title, you may see a description or other information about the discussion assignment, or you might see a link that says View Full Description. If so, click the link to see additional information about the discussion topic. In this example, the instructor also included the dates the forum will be available. Some instructors may ask that you first post a response to the discussion topic before you can see your classmates' posts. That's what we'll need to do in this example. To create a post in a discussion topic, click the topic's title, and then start a new conversation. In the title box, type a subject for your post, and in the text editor, type your response. If desired, you can first compose your response in a word processor such as Word, and then copy and paste it into the text editor. As you're writing your post, remember that you can click on View Full Description to see assignment details if provided. This is also a useful way to check that you've responded in such a way that meets your instructor's expectations. Before submitting your post, it's a good idea to run the spell checker. In the toolbar above the text editor, click the icon with the check mark. Possible errors will be underlined. Right click on underlined words to choose options and make corrections. It's important to remember that spell checkers are not perfect. Make sure to reread your post and proofread your work carefully. When you're ready to submit, scroll down and click Post. To read a classmate's post, click the subject. If you'd like to reply to it, click Reply and then type your response in the text editor. When you're done, click Post and your reply appears. Here's a couple of tips to help you as you use the discussion forum. First, when navigating around in the discussion forum or anywhere in Sakai, it's important to never use your browser's back button. Instead, use the breadcrumb trail at the top of the forum's tool. Second, you can view all of the responses in a discussion topic by clicking Display Message Content. This is a great way to see the flow of conversation. If you see a response you'd like to reply to, Click its Reply button. Third, by default, Sakai sends you an email when a conversation you have posted to receives a new message. To reduce the number of emails you receive, click the Watch button on the main forums page. From here, you can choose No Notification and then click Save. Once you feel comfortable using the discussion forum, you may find that it's a great way to get to know the views and opinions of your classmates. If you need additional assistance while using the forum, please visit the student help page or contact Sakai Help at durhamtech.edu.